Yo, what up? Welcome back, guys. So today we're going to start a new series. Today we're going to be watching Hawkeye from, you know, Disney Plus, you know, the Marvel Cinematic. I rock with it. So to finish Loki, I know, and what if. Uh, don't worry about that. I saw a lot of requests for this, so not a lot, but you know what I mean? Damn, stop playing. I'm going to see season one, episode one. Never meet your hero. Oh, okay. So I'm going to assume uh, Kate Bishop and uh, Hawkeye sock on the wrong feet. <laughs> that part is, I know the villain's... Uh, only thing I know is the villain is what's the guy? What's the guy? Kingpin? But I don't think he's shown. So I don't know who the villain is. I just know it's Kingpin. Or I've been lied to. Other than that, uh completely new. I'm pretty good at avoiding spoilers because I literally watch the only thing I watch is YouTube and Twitch. So I can't really get spoiled on that. YouTube tries though sometimes. Hey, best luck to you. So let's just get into this. Hawkeye, would I say he's my favorite Avenger? No, is he top ten? No. And that doesn't even make sense because there's not even 10 of them. But I do enjoy him. Kate Bishop, I enjoy it. I, I like her more than Hawkeye. It, and that's because of the of the game. The Avengers game. I know you guys are saying, oh, that game's trash. It's hey, hey, I enjoyed it. Okay. Come on now. Let's just get into this. Thank you guys for really kicking on the video. Really do appreciate it. And let's go. You know, maybe growing up in this place, you got used to the idea that a solution will just fall out of the sky. But it won't, Derek. What does that mean? You, you guys knew she was home. Kate. Why are you even try to act like you're asleep? We heard everything. Calm now. What would you do in a hurricane? I would do Run. what I always do. Protect you. So two people die. Alright, good job, man. This is a pretty nice house. It can be pretty fun too, you know. I bet you didn't know I could do this. <laughs> what? Ow. Oh, no, not the lamp. Oh, if I was a lamp, the only thing that fell. That's what I'm saying. Like if the if the if my hotel is not hotel, but my house is shaking, I'm like, okay, where's my kid? The dad's lying to us. What would happen to like in a disaster, hurricane, whatever? I'll come protect you, like I always do. Where is he right now? Hmm. <laughs> I like to know where he's at. That's pretty dangerous. Let's not stand next to the window. Ooh, Hawkeye. The budget that they have on these is actually crazy. Yeah, that's pretty cool. To be honest, if I saw a human jump out of jump off a building with a bow like that, I'd be like, that guy's different. That guy's different. He died? Bro, he died off camera? I could have wrote a better script. <laughs> Unless he's the villain. Hmm. Expertise. I need a bow and arrow. Let me bow and arrow. <laughs> uh, oh, by the way, I should have probably said this in the in the beginning. I don't know anything about Kate Bishop. The only thing I knew is like she uses a bow and arrow. So I don't even know if there is, this is correct origin story. Obviously not, because it's more like an MCU. I'm saying like some stuff if they hit at her origin or stuff, I will not catch it. It will completely go over my head. Just letting you know. Green. Kate, what is that name? Green. Oh crap. I thought my furniture was levitating. Okay. So the real question. Does the bell swing back and forth, or does the dangling thingy in the middle swing back and forth? It's obviously the bell. See? The, the bell I swings disagree. back and forth. I think it's the dangling thingy. Why? It, by the way, Kate. Yeah, well... We literally see the bell go like this. What are you talking about? This is good form. This is good form. Let's see how she releases it. Oh, uh, You want to just take your fingers off of it? Not 
think about it, aren't they both moving? I feel like there's no right answer to this question. What? There is no way the building can support that. You know what? Not the brightest idea. Does he realize he doesn't get a part? Oh, no, Black Whip. Oh, this is after Endgame. Did you turn your hearing aid off? No, honey, I know. I know what happens. I was there. You knew it was. True. I'll be right back. Yeah, I'll be right back too. There she is. Okay. And also, zero. Nah, I want to see who wrote that. I want them to come in here real quick. Oh, no. Nah. He literally picked the stall next to him. He's a villain. He's a villain. Oh, uh, Hawk, Hawkman, do your job. Really rad, dude. My kids would flip. I mean, you're their absolute favorite. Yeah. This guy said so, man, bro. You couldn't wait till he gets out the bathroom. Thank you, man. He said, can I get a selfie next to those urinals? Wait, her stuff just... Isn't this apartment that was wrecked? She paid to have it fixed? Oh, you look uh, amazing. these rich, rich, rich. I'm thrilled that I'm about to replace an irreplaceable clock tower. It was a bell tower. The dean said it had a bell and a clock, and overachiever that you are, you managed to destroy both. Hey, good aim, good aim. I know that young people think they're invincible, and rich people think they're invincible, and you have always been both, so take it from someone who hasn't. You're not. You will get hurt. So please, don't go out looking for it. Oh, good parent. Parenting. I support. Uh, there have been a few changes while you're away this semester. Shut up. Jack! Oh! <laughs> what an unexpected surprise. Ha ha ha. What? You know what's right down the street? The Christmas tree. The oh. biggest one you'll ever see in your life. It's enormous. You guys want to go see that after this? Yeah! Yeah, yeah let's go! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Why isn't the wife here? Mama calling. Mama's calling. Say hi. Hi, Mom. Great hi, timing, to be honest. Hey, guys. How are you? I miss you so much. Well, we miss you, too. How was the show? It was, it was, uh, uh, it was going. It was, it was big. We <laughs> left halfway there through. There you go. There you have it. Oh, no. That was just halfway through? Oh, God. Oh, thank you for sparing us. Fill it with a lot of Christmas activities. What's your favorite one? Um, Gingerbread House. We're doing that. What do you got? Uh, Christmas movie marathon. Movie marathon. Awesome. Uh, ugly sweaters. Ugly Christmas sweaters. And we have to decorate the tree. We have just yeah. a thousand things to do. It's going to be fun. Gonna Live be your fun. life. That's what I like to see. Uh, get back to work. Oh. <laughs> what up, Kate Bishop? How's it going? You know, it's unfair. I never looked that good in a tuxedo in my <laughs> life. I'd appreciate it if you wear something a little more ladylike for the wedding so we won't be competing. What wedding? You don't know. Huh? Ellen and Jack. God, those secretive little lovebirds. They didn't even tell their own, I mean, her own daughter. What? I, I mean, I guess that's what they were, she was going to do here. Uh, another Armand, I see. Yes, I'm Armand the third, and he's Armand the seventh. I believe that's quite sufficient. What, dude? Stop. There should only it should stop after two. There's no way you guys went up to seven. <laughs> Go, girl, confront her. This, yes, this is what we need. Confrontation. He should have told you. You're engaged. Oh well, I guess the beans are out of the bag. Shut the hell up, dude. Nobody's talking to you. Wow. Can, can we have a little moment? Oh no, yeah, of course, please. of course. It's almost time for my uh, engagement anyway. Right. Uh, that's. I don't even know these people. And I, I, I'm, I'm offended. Is there a part of you that could be happy for me? <laughs> Maybe. Yes. Maybe like five percent. Yes, mom. Of course. See, look at five percent. Are we getting those numbers out there? Dog. Hi. Heck of a party, huh? This Kate. I know. 
I didn't think Kate Bishop had a dog. I'm pretty. I know. Oct I had one. What's going on? Gary wants you to bring these down right away. Just these two? These two. They're making Arm Arm seem like the villain, but he can't be the villain, bro. That guy? No. Okay, the husband's here, and he's gonna sit next to Arm Arm. We'll start the bidding for this magnificent skull. At two million dollars, do I get two million dollars? Two mil? I'll give you two bucks, homie. Great. I thought I was supposed to be the only one working here. Uh, Gary, Gary sent me to work here. Who told you to come down here? Who's this now? Gary. I'm Gary. What's your name? You guys snitched. What's the problem, Gary. You don't even know my name. You know, I, this this is just, I'm, this is not oh, gonna work out. I quit. You, you can't quit. Hold on. Oh, she's good. One of the best. From the wreckage of the Avengers compound. Now you may recall. Compound. Hey, yo. The criminal underworld of this. Yeah, city. you be robbing the compound. I thought that that should have been Tony Stark. What is it? Damage control. D damage control should handle that. Four fifty. Four ten. Bro, I can't hear them. Ready? Oh, he about to air this place out. Seventy-five is going twice. Sold for four hundred and seventy-five thousand dollars. Up next, we have lot number three hundred nine. The Affinity Stone. Ronin suit. What? These guys got everything from the compound. Wait, what's next from the auction? Captain America shield. Smart man, I would have took it. Is this how she meets Hawkeye? She takes this and she dresses up in it, and he's like, "Why is that? Why is my costume on the street?" It was still rolling then. Ah! Oh my! Poor. Wait, you guys are terrible. I know she's a black belt and all, but like, you guys catch a lot one punch. Ah. What? Okay, buddy. What? How do you fumble the bag that bad? I mean, I'm not in the side, but. Oh. Okay, wait. He actually it looks like he actually knows what he's doing. What? I don't know if that's skill or luck. It has to be one. I'm shocked you knocked him out. Cause assuming if I saw somebody get attacked by a dog, I'd be like. Who do I help here? <laughs> What's going on here? What? There's no way that dog didn't get hit. Why do you raise his mask? Check it out. A ninja saved a dog. Oh, it's amazing. Yep, of course. So that's my suit. What's going on? How does your phone work with gloves? Do not destroy this apartment. Wait, you turn off the lights? You could have like left the lamp on or something for him. Oh, a body? They killed a mod like that? Good thing we got out of there. Because if, if you were got caught at that scene, that would have been on the news. 
And he found you like this? Damn, you guys are quick. Are you making it so tough on us, bro? Now they're talking like that. Oh. I respect it. Oh, all that talk you got dropped like that? Sir? Oh, that was nice. That was a nice maneuver. Oh, the real Ronin showed up. Come on. You're a, you're a Hawkeye. And who the hell are you? That store's lying, buddy. Okay, good at good first episode. Okay, Bishop. I like it. A lot of uh, I guess I don't know who the evil people are still. Uh, it just seems like a bunch of random guys. Uh, I have no idea. They didn't say the organization. They didn't say nothing. They just robbed this uh, underground casino. No, it's a Galleria. I'm pretty sure it was a Galleria. Underground auction for a watch. But it is from Tony. So I assume it's probably like the, the watch that can turn into a blaster. It could be that one. Uh, I don't know. Okay, so let's get into a little bit. The mom's marrying this one guy. The one guy doesn't seem to be rich. So uh, I'm a little bit, a little bit confused on his motives. Armand's dead though, and he wanted Kate Bishop's mom dead. So in the end, we but when we get to the end, Kate Bishop's mom could be the evil person, because he was like, he was apparently threatening her, or I don't know what's going on. Didn't hear the conversation, and then the man ends up dead a couple hours later. Come on, it could also be the husband, but like, come on now, he had he got in the sword, so like, there's no point in him actually gonna kill her to actually kill him or whatever he got the sword that's what he wanted you know so Amar's dead uh so I, I, he can't be on my suspiciously uh you know meter like i always said if i see the body and it's dead i'm assuming they're dead he's not coming back uh kate bishop doesn't have any training but she's still pretty good at fighting but she they do land a lot of hits so i'm like okay realistic so now that they met up. I'm assuming uh, episode three, Hawkeye might train her around there. So, yeah, I enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. Really do appreciate it. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. Really does help me out. And catch you guys next time for another episode. I don't know. Pretty good so far. I'll watch more.